Hey guys, how's it going? Kriparian here. Today is the first episode of the Salt Chronicles on the main channel. So Salt Chronicles is someone who made like really well and intricate edited compilations of the salty moments that I experienced on stream. And the videos were pretty good, good enough that we thought we'd give them a chance on our main channel. So this is the first episode on the main channel. We'd like to make them a fairly regular thing. We're thinking, you know, maybe two, maybe three times a month, but if you guys really love it, you guys can show us that. You guys can tell us about it in the comments and uh, you guys can share it with your friends. If, if this video gets a lot of views or a lot of thumbs up or something, it tells us that you guys really want more of this content and I guess we can make more of it more so than maybe a few times a month. So let us know what you think. If you love this content, please tell us because we're really eyeing information from that. Uh, now Salt Chronicles, he's been doing videos like these in the past. He used to have his Patreon. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video and there is more to come. Are you Welcome. kidding me? The salty bruh? It is I. The salty? From the salt. vegetable man. Give me another emote. How are you? Before you play your crappy card. What the f How is that zero one? That guy's deck was crazy. It is I, the vegetable man. Accurate. Dude is nearly dead. Three off lethal right now. Oh, right, he has razor pedals. Wow, that's some bullshit. It's total garbage. Oh well. On cue board clear. Thanks game. Okay, yeah, I know I top decked an answer, but he top decked Firelands, and it happened that we got into Grim Patron. But we also got super super. F okay. That was lucky into lucky. Like, Dragon's Fury is his next draw. Wow, that's some bullshit. Like, both players are drawing crazy well. Wow. Crazy. You're in trouble now. Mm -hmm. What the f yeah! Two Abyssal Enforcers. Holy crap. This guy's deck is unbelievable. All right. I could never dream of drafting a deck like that. Nope. Like I had two Felfire Potion, two Abyssal, really good tempo cards, but he went second. And <laughs> Crips Lil Cock. Oh man, that's a new one in the Crip family. I feel offended by this. I think I should report him to Blizzard. Yes, that would rectify the situation. Maybe he means what? Maybe he means Coke and that you couldn't fit. Oh yeah, I do have those little Coke can things. Uh, no, all right, okay, that's totally what it is. All right. I don't really ever mind these names, guys, but I don't like getting sniped. I can actually ping my own face to make the lesser spellstone stronger. Like if my play is just to ping his face normally, I might as well do that. Oh, it's from your cards. Oh my god, I'm dumb. Yeah, that's a problem. Shame concede. It mean, really would not have made a difference. It was over the moment I pinged my own face. I guess so. Both those cards are win more, even though they're small. They start to snowball really hard. That's what. Ah, uh, maybe we'll play some Legends tomorrow. You failed the guess. That's actually hilarious.
Oh wait, it doesn't actually kill it. Oh my god, that's a disaster. So, I don't know how well Runeterra will do when, like, the next League of Legends game comes out. Man, I am pretty screwed. Too many strong cards. Or I can do Dragonfire if he goes wide, I guess. Or I can lose my guy. It's crazy. These guys are committed. Man, that hat is actually pretty annoying. Oh, that could have been Dart Trap. Oh my god, it is Dart Trap. Hit my face, hit my face. I get so far and then... RNG, okay. like, it's on my face. Okay, that's definitely gotta die here. Shallow Gravedigger, a new Barak. <sighs> so many just super bombs. And that Explorer's hat is carrying so much weight. And I can't draw minions for <laughs> Can't top deck for What the hell is happening right now, dude? <sighs> Tertolan Forager. Getting wrecked by crazy high roll right now. Get Tyrannosaurus wrecked. Look at that. Holy sh! Isn't the Explorer's hat off RNG as well? Time for Explorer's hat. Why doesn't he play it on a big minion? So I can polymorph it already. We are probably getting sniped and hurt down right now. Alright, there's a chance. You can get Death Knights, that's correct. Hey, Scotty. Jesus. Dude, is that the third one? Special delivery! <laughs> Bombs away! This guy's deck is insane, but he's also insanely lucky. What the hell is this guy played that wasn't great? I'm dead, right? 7-7, seven, seven, hero power. Yeah, I'm dead. Trash player, crazy deck, crazy lucky. I don't get you for RNG, right? Alright, I'll finish the rerun tomorrow, but... This one's pretty brutal, I'd say. Should probably kill that. I don't know, let's see what I get. Yeah, let's kill that. Oh my god. Yeah, let's kill that. Oh my god. Gosh, I gotta stop reading chat during this turn. Ah, oh, I'm so, so flippy. Off to a great start already, yeah. This guy's playing some really good stuff too. Just don't know how to deal with these gigantic minions right now. Oh yeah, okay, I guess. Like, that only does five damage. Oh god. Oh, well, oh, Polly, easy. God damn it, I really suck today. I'm thinking with these board clears and being at 30 health. Dude, this guy's deck is fing crazy. Are you serious right now? That guy could easily get 12 wins. Easily. That's the second good legendary. He had zero bad cards. He had ridiculous cards overall. What is the new combo warrior? 
I don't know if I'm getting sniped. I don't know if that was just the unluckiest kid ever. Damn. Doesn't matter. Alright, this is getting serious bullshit levels. Absolute bullshit. He's played Sylvanas Nazoth, Nexus Champion. This is two and two, by the way. Come on! Fuck. This is so not a two and two deck. Seriously! Oh, and the Poison Sledge in there? How did he generate that? I don't think that was in his deck. Moonglade Portal. Oh, Malorn was in his deck. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? I don't know how to kill that. So he's played five legendaries. At two and two. And they're all good. All of them. <laughs> how is this? Two and two. This guy's deck is unbelievable. Six legendaries. And they're dragons as well. That was like super fing never lucky. <laughs> what is this is two and two? It's 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 not like I'm at like ten and zero and I'm like oh my god another dragon. You know, and yeah, okay. You know. Guy hit the jackpot and he got really lucky this game. Yep. Whatever, right? No, it's not that. It's two and two. This guy lost. I got super unlucky in my first few games. It's a pretty good deck, but... Obviously, it's not winning right now. Want it. I got it. <sighs> got a light bomb here. It's pretty annoying. You wish to Are you kidding me? Okay. Six health, one, two, three. Oh, God. I'm probably just gonna lose the fatigue. I think I'm dead now. I can't kill him fast enough. Like, I still die in three turns to fatigue. I just went two and three with a really good deck. Having to kill six good legendaries. Six. Insane. I don't know. I mean, in terms of RNG and stuff, it was pretty fair. I mean, he did get pretty lucky getting some of those legendaries, but... That guy's deck just did not belong at 2-2. Two two. My deck didn't belong at 2-2, two two, but his deck really, really, really didn't belong at 2-2. Two two. I think I'm pretty fair when it comes to dropping those excuses. That's when, my, that's when I get, like, suspicious about shit. And it's over! Can I please play without crying? Nah, dude, that's part of the stream. That's what I do. Are you Welcome. kidding me? It is I. Wow. The vegetable wow. man. Wow. How are you? Wow. What the f How is that 0-1? That guy's deck was crazy. I just don't have answers! Okay, he needs another answer to deal with this. More answers. Freaking god, dude, come on! But no, I, I can't win anymore. Lost versus Hunter Warrior. Awful on top of awful. Dog shit on top of dog shit on top of constantly triggered on top of total garbage on top of garbage <laughs> But went first got win more cards got lucky and I did not get lucky. I didn't get shit for answers Second again 
Well, five in a row. That's garbage. It's pretty ridiculous. God bless. Going second. Jesus, win. Is this the same guy who I played the first match? It's like the same cards. Go first, same cards, same win more condition. Same bullshit in the game I lost. Same bullshit in all the games I lost tonight. That's insane. It's not like standard arena. There's like 10 expansions in arena right now. It's near full wild. If this stream hits 10,000 viewers tonight, I raid one of the artifact streamers. <laughs> but why? All right, I lost my first game. And then I went second seven consecutive times. Skill doesn't matter for shit. And going second is bullshit. Is this it? Did we just go first? Oh my god! Oh my god. I don't even know what to do. Where's my coin? I've been so used to playing with one. Oh Jesus. Seriously? Jesus, punish. I threw so hard this run. Bless you. I think that last game I could have lived another turn, but calling that a throw is a far cry. Like, we lost that game by a lot. The other games that we lost, we had like no chance. It just got destroyed. Like, the three losses we incurred with this were not close. I missed lethal the other game, but then I won it. Chat. Often enough, I guess. Kinda sucks. Duplicates. Oh yeah, he ruined my Kazakus. I have two spider things, and two priests of the feast once again. Not so much, like, are you kidding me? This is bullshit. This is such bullshit. This is my 0-0 zero zero opponent. Steward of Darkshire, Vine Cleaver combo. Psychic scream into psychic scream. By the light. For duty. So, for duty. like, we live here. Look at this shit, dude. No shit. Yeah, I'm dead. You have best. That was like the most bullshit game I've ever played in this dual arena. He's about to die, Psychic Scream draw. He's about to die, Psychic Scream number two. And then crazy as hell combo. All of those are like 110 plus point cards. It's insane. Um, Psychic Scream is very rare. I've never seen two in like the first nine turns. It's actually ridiculous. According to me, every game I play is bullshit. But mostly the losses, but that's because I'm pretty decent at the game. What do you expect? I I don't think you can play much better than I can in Arena. Yet drooling noobs will still win. Um, yes, I I don't get frustrated when something catastrophic happens in a video game. Let's try this so I don't have to take the damage. By the light. Never lucky. Yeah, dude, while well, you're playing Diablo Immortal, you know, if you guys have phones. There's sometimes issues. Um, that's a pretty good pickup. Blessed 
Alright. Jesus. This is one of those super bullshit games. It's literally win more, win more, win more, win more, and I can't counter a one drop. This is such bull. I'm at one. Examples of an underrated card. What do you mean? This guy basically had Zombie Chow while I had nothing until turn three, and on turn three, he comboed with the coin an oil, and then he drew perfect answers since then. If I can kill the Zombie Chow, I'll be fine, so just have to stay alive. I think Dark Bomb is the only two mana card that kills me. Yeah. Some chance this guy's watching the stream, by the way. There's no Eviscerate. Oh, Jade Shuriken. Getting sniped. And it happened that we got sniped. Just gonna catch it. <laughs> but we also got super, super sniped on the testicles, huh? <laughs> I didn't mean that. I did catch it, but... <laughs> I'm sorry, I thought it would... That was not the best location to throw something. I thought it would break. <laughs> wow, you nailed me. I'm gonna lose this game, by the way. This guy's playing way too many good cards, way too many win more cards, and he went first. I can't kill that. I don't have many answers in this deck. Like, this game, I don't know if he's sniping, but everything is working out perfectly convenient for him. Is this the same player from, like, three games ago? Like my my zero zero opponent with the craziest hell deck. Like this is so bullshit. Look at this. He doesn't even have a paladin hero power, and he has this much synergy going on. Oh. Oh, hold on. We're getting somewhere. That was a really clutch bomb. Oh! That's a really clutch cog hammer. Okay. Okay. This might work. Damn. Oh. Don't worry. Game fixes everything. That was his draw. He top decked Unstable Portal into Sleepy Dragon. <laughs> no! Just give him a bad spell. Come on, we're due here. Dude is 100% sniping. Everything's working out conveniently. Like, he has not played around a single card that I don't actually have. Alright, nothing. Well played. Did we win? Oh, oh my, my god. god! That's surprising. Can I just lead of the sniper guild? <laughs> yeah, probably. I've played this guy tonight already. Seriously? When did I play him? How am I getting sniped so much? Oh, that hurts. If that's the case, that's ridiculous. I haven't even streamed that long. God. It'd be such an asshole to snipe twice in three hours. I played him literally two hours ago. He's a priest warlock, and he lost. He's probably salty as hell, sniping and losing. 
He's probably repeating it to himself in his head that I'm the salty one. You salty, bruh? You salty? Show me the salt. Jesus. If he has in two, I instantly lose. Yep. Yeah, this guy's deck is ridiculous. He probably had saved a ridiculous deck, managed to actually lose while sniping, and decided to snipe again because he got an even more ridiculous deck on the same night. Even though all this crap, I still had a chance with a new Brock, but uh, he had the best answer in the game. There's very little removal for a new Barak. Entomb is the only efficient one. I'm not happy getting sniped by anyone. I don't... don't really uh, condone... concede wins. That's a nuts card. I mean, I don't have spell damage, so that card's horrible. If he was not sniping, he would go face here. That doesn't prove he's sniping. Not everyone snipes. Well, today it's been quite bad. Yeah, most people would make the trade. I just said... It doesn't prove that he's sniping when he made the trade. Doesn't prove it. It's just, if he didn't trade, he's definitely not sniping. And you might think I'm just complaining here, but I'm not. That's relevant information. If I know my opponent is not sniping me, I actually am going to play a little bit differently. I got the 7 HP, but that was not great. Another 100 plus point card. Seriously, like, the card quality I'm facing is outrageous. Kazakus is not active right now. How are all my 0 0 games total bullshit? Half his deck, he's got three jades out. It's literally like a normal jade shaman. It's still a lot. What the hell? He's got three jade lightnings! Half the deck! What the fudge? This guy's deck is unbelievable. That's crazy, dude. I can't believe that deck exists. This guy's deck is just... It's one of those, like, 80 pointers. No, it's probably like 75, but it's got extreme synergy. <laughs> That's so bad for me. I don't think there's much I could do to win, dude. Five jades, dude. Well, I don't- he hasn't made any play that suggests he's sniping, but at the same time he hasn't needed to. Because his deck is like... Like, you, you can't really lose with this. Yeah, I'm dead. Could Entomb save me? It would only save me if he played like one big card and then had nothing else. Well, it's not just better deck. Better deck is like, yeah, well, it's either better or worse. 50-50. No, it's like a bell curve. It's like, I think I have a pretty decent deck. I'm like a 6-4 height. Let's say I'm a basketball player. All right. If some dude shows up and he's like 7 foot 9... It's not like, yeah, he's just taller, whatever, 50-50. He's either going to be taller than you or shorter than you. No, that's like, you draft like a thousand decks and that's like the best one. Right? Like, that's that's kind of the, the basis of the frustration here. A quick shot? Damn, what a draw. Wow. This guy's drawn crazy as hell cards in a row here. Okay, that's not too bad. Wow. Pretty bad. Alright, he's out of cards. 
I just need him to not draw something crazy. He's playing Hunter Hero Power. He shouldn't have that much late game, so... <sighs> really, man? <sighs> it's the worst card in my deck. It's the only card I can't play. It's not really a top deck war. I was two cards ahead. It's just he's drawn cra- Look at that! What the hell? He's playing Hunter Hero Power. He has to play aggressive. He's drawn heavy cards. Every single turn. Okay. This is actually pretty good. This is the first. Not bad. <laughs> True, the other one. It's the first slightly weak card he's drawn in like seven turns. I think I take this. It threatens lethal. He has to draw to kill me. There you go. So it was about a seven turn top deck war. That guy had absolutely crazy turns. His worst turn was playing the four mana four four, the turn before he killed me. I started two cards ahead and I drew the three worst cards in my deck. Both shifting scrolls and the glacial shard. Like we were not supposed to lose that. We really were not. Double good one drop. What do you mean can I lose to a 0-2? This guy's playing an excellent deck right now. Of course I can lose to him. Like, this is... So far, he's played like a constructed zoo game. So far. Yeah, I hope that stops, but... At 0-2... Look, look at this shit. This is bullshit, dude. Seriously. That's impossible. Right? That, guy, that guy's playing a deck that loses to nothing. What do you mean? This is 0-2! This is the... On average, this is the easiest p opponent in all of Arena. And this guy is playing pure constructed cards. Wh how, do you, how do you get this deck? I don't understand. If he went first, I would have lost, like, by a landslide. I haven't drafted anything even close to this deck. I have to be getting sniped. There's no chance that this is, like, a legit match right now. There's no chance. I think I might win because I went first. But not, not because my deck is better. Another ridiculous card. Zero two is the easiest score to snipe. He needs another answer. He's got two top decks and one card for a few turns. Another peddler. I just want to point out this guy's deck on average right now is in the high 70s. What a relief. Get so far and then RNG like shits on my face. Ah, ah. All right, dude, that is some next level BS. What? That's one of the best spells below five. It targeted one of my guys and it rolled enough to kill it. That's like in the top one percent of results there. I'm sure there are better ones, but like I'm not I'm not sure what those are. <laughs> Five mana, five four, deal three, summon three one ones. Would see play in any deck. Yeah, of course. Reality woven. Are you serious? He has mage secrets with mysterious challenger. Who am I? Nobody. 
I'm nobody. Yeah, I think I lost. I'm behind way too many cards. I was winning by a lot, but he got bailed out by extreme RNG. I will purify them. That's so sick. Wait, he went face? He has all minions, so most minions are not answers. If he doesn't kill this, then I dictate the death rattle a lot more, which is pretty bad for him. Oh, right, I forgot he had that. Okay, never mind, I'm pretty screwed. I do need to get a bit lucky to win, but I'm actually able to win, which is crazy. <laughs> We literally are ahead on the board if he didn't have three damage and three one ones. I tried so hard, guys, but that arena run was not meant to be. Can you just hero power my Reaper and then go face? He did. Would you ever, 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 ever do that for any reason other than to play around Ravaging Ghoul? Is there any other card where making that move is good? Because I think he's sniping. That play is so terrible in every other situation. Too many Divine Shields, too much tempo, too much win more stuff. One thing my deck doesn't have is board clears. I'm almost dead on the board, and my play this turn is awful. This is my play. <laughs> he kills it with a 1-1 one, one and this. So basically, he loses, let's say, a 3-drop for my turn 8 play while he's already winning. Yeah, it's just too much win more stuff. There's another one more card. It's literally win more, win more, win more, win more, and I can't counter a one drop. That's awful play, but doesn't really matter, I guess. He has all minion hand right now. So the win more is really serious. Whenever someone plays a win more card going first, I'm like, cry. You bet high, so if you don't mind. Oh, okay. I protect. Okay. The victory is yours. Almost every single card he played is win more. Uh, all right. Well, there are like 80 point decks right now. Are Welcome. you kidding me? The salty, bruh? It is I. The salty? Come to this vegetable land. Give me another emote. How are you? Before you play your crappy card. What the fuck? How is that zero one? That guy's deck was crazy. Guess I play this and hope for a two or three drop next turn. Ouch. Yep, pretty screwed. Wow. Okay. Crazy Z deck with insane curve. Kind of sucks. This? Oh, barbecue crip. Thanks, dude. What a tragedy! Better write this down. Please stop playing good cards. Wanna blow something up? <clears throat> this might hurt. Okay, I guess I lose. 
going first with a near perfect curve all the way up to turn eight. This might hurt. You literally don't lose ever doing that. Salt is still here, praise the Lord. Dude, I just got on and within 10 seconds I'm getting absolutely aced. So yeah. All decks in Arena have a pretty similar curve. So going first and drawing a perfect curve is literally just Blizzard gifting you a win. Oh, I got a butterfly at least, thank you. Typically going first you have the tempo advantage, but you typically miss a few curve drops because you have less cards and less cards to mulligan. That's typically how that works. You think coin extra card is the best solution in going second disadvantage? In constructed, it's fine. Yeah, in constructed, it works out. But in arena, it's not really enough. And Blizzard doesn't really change the game for arena sake, so kind of sucks. Like, look how hard this game has been. All the rogue had is two drop, three drop, four drop of fair quality. That's it. And it's almost impossible to keep up. I had a great curve. Turn two weapon. I coin out a three on turn three. Right? I just can't do anything. Like how how can you feel satisfied about a game like that? Like yeah, I complain a lot and shit, but like what the fuck do you expect, dude? Like if, if the player who goes first gets a good hand, it just wins. It doesn't happen very often, but there's not much skill involved in it. Look at that. <laughs> what the fuck? Alright. I guess we lose one again. There's like no way I can make it to turn 8 to heal or clear or anything. Like, even if I go Doomsayer, I die to the death rattles. Turn six loss. Because I went second and my opponent got really lucky. God, going second. God, my opponent got really lucky. Again. Wow. This is like the worst start I've ever had playing Hearthstone, actually. Alright, <laughs> let's play again and hope if we go second that our opponent doesn't draw a perfect curve again. There's really no gameplay. There's 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 no plays, there's no drafting, there's nothing that can be done to overcome going second against the perfect curve. There's nothing. It doesn't exist. Alright, well, I went second again. <laughs> going second again. Wow, dude. Can I catch a f***ing break? It's Warrior. Shaman has a really good matchup against Warrior. So we'll see. If you played Perfect Curve, shouldn't you be favored? Isn't that how the game should work? No, that's not how it works. Um, yeah. But, uh, that, that is kind of how the game works. But, um, I'm thinking that the frequency of your opponent having a Perfect Curve going first shouldn't be that high, and I just experienced it twice back to back within like four minutes. Card's really annoying. I mean never punished. We got like a break finally from going second and the carnage of perfect everything. Cards in my deck are very strong right now. Cards in hand are quite strong. Two of the cards in his hand are just completely random, so... It's a bit of a problem. Wow, Runner Runner Stormforce Axe. That's horrible. Look at that! Wow. Today has been a real f circus, man. Let's do 
one stacked because it has six health, and one unstacked. <laughs> Just for flexibility against uh, a bunch of small things. Six cards left. Really? <clears throat> I'm still very behind, but he's running. I'm gonna say he's running pure top decks right now, so. I get so far and then. Special delivery! <laughs> like, shits on my face. My RNG has been dog shit. Particularly bad dog shit, even though it has been generally bad dog shit. So, I'm really hoping he runs out of answers. Really rough start today, but catching up. <laughs> that might not be a good idea. Just play a bunch of crap on the board. Okay. You didn't need that, did you? That could be bad. So I guess that's four games that we got completely fucked by RNG in a row, right? That is pretty bad. But that was certainly not fine. The best play is actually this one. Because he's going to want to use that Divine Shield at risk of losing it. So if he uses his Divine Shield, I gain the life I would otherwise lose. Top deck Caligos out of cards. That deserves an applause right there, boys. Did he get the one spell that actually kills me? He did. Top deck Caligos into Pyroblast. Well, I think we were pretty likely to win that game, but um, Hearthstone said no. But um, Hearthstone said fuck you. Hearthstone said get fucked. Hearthstone said get fucking wrecked. Hearthstone said get fucking Tyrannosaurus wrecked. Look at that, holy shit. Kriparian said, Can I stop getting fucked on RNG? All three of our losses were basically some variation of that game. Absolutely no gameplay involved for us to have a chance. Even with a Caligas Pyroblast, we were probably going to win if it picked... Basically, the only thing that caused me to lose that game was Hex on my own minion. That could be bad. Even if it Ancestral Spirit's his guy, it's fine. So that was a 1 in 4. The only really bad thing was Hex on my guy. 1 in 4. Off the Saboteur. Everything else didn't really matter. And it's over! Can I please play without crying? <laughs> nah, dude, that's part of the stream. That's what I do. Are you Welcome. kidding me? The salty bra? It is I. The salty? From the vegetable land. Give me another emote. How are you? Before you play your crappy card. What the fuck? How is that zero one? That guy's deck was crazy. Okay. Dinomancy in arena. There are some cards that just need to be really, really, really rare. And that's one of them.
because you never want it in your deck. I think his deck's pretty solid. That's what she said. 70.3. Or he said. That's it. That was worth emoting over. This sick play right here. Killing a three drop and effectively a free zero drop. Not even fully. On a full turn six going first. Damn! Still gonna lose? Well, I went second to Hunter Mare, so yeah, probably. Have he sent them both in? It's pretty crazy. Incoming lost the double pit croc. Not quite. He's not really able to play a whole lot, and even if he kills my beasts, I have the, um... Wow, that's really good. I was a huge toad kill command. I think there is no better card than that. Alright. Basically, all of what I did is not possible if I went second. Ah, going second again. Ah, guess that's it, guys. We kind of just got a free ticket this game. Awful play. I don't think so. That's a pretty awful play, but hey, paid off. We're doing okay. I mean, going second, we're almost even on the board in HP. <laughs> that's that's pretty good. Still probably gonna lose, man. Okay, he needs another answer to deal with this. I just need him to have no answer here, and I'd actually probably win. Oh, rip, we lose. Fucking god, dude, come on! He's actually bullshit, like, he's just like... Answer, 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 no cards, answer, 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 like what the fuck, this is just happening constantly. Same bullshit in the game I lost, same bullshit in all the games I lost tonight. Okay, we need to dodge an answer, again. It's three and zero, but he has had quite a few. Miss chance to double taunt. Yes, such a miss. Ah, perfect answer again. Yeah. Just still getting answered. Can't win. Not going second against so many good answers. What the hell has this guy played that wasn't great? Copy pasta culture. Well, it's like typing in chat without any effort. It's pretty good. Hey, more perfect curves, good answer, mix. Nice. Yeah, we lose. Yeah, we lose. Out of four games, I think three of them we won or lost almost automatically first versus second. Is it possible your opponent played better? Sure, could be slightly possible, didn't really seem to be that case, but uh, typically you lose twice as much going second. And uh, in the mirrors of like temp tempo aggro versus tempo aggro, it's worse than the average. Sure. Basically, in a tempo slash aggro mirror, 
the player going second has to draw substantially better to win. Uh, I was thinking of playing a little bit more PoE, but yeah, the PvE stuff is coming out tomorrow, so I don't really know when that's going to be. What is that? Wow. This energy. So strong. I think she is pretty strong. Two one drops, two into a three with synergy mana acceleration. It's actually very strong. So like okay, whatever. Wow, pre nerf hex dude. Oh, to the P. Yeah, my opponent's playing on curve really, really well. My options are pretty weak. Like this on five, this on six. Another very strong answer. Yeah, my opponents are all like, answer, answer, answer. Crazy card, crazy combo. There's a good chance we'll actually lose this now. Wow. Wow. Crazy combo, crazy RNG. <laughs> That's the best six. <laughs> and might just be the best eight. Oh. It's a terrible nine if he doesn't have a dragon. Not that good of a dragon, but uh, it's pretty hard to get through that right now. I don't have enough mana. Oh, rip. So yeah, this is what I was talking about. This is what has to happen for you to lose going second. It's pretty ridiculous. Honestly, we haven't quite lost yet. <laughs> Just need like a stealth. Not too bad. If I got stealth on that, I think I probably would have won, by the way. Not too far off, but yeah. You saw the crazy as hell turns that he had. It's not too far off. Like, one more turn and we had it. If he didn't have that weapon... Probably would've won. Yeah, I'd fully expect to hit there. Um... Well, he had a much better curve than I did, and then he evolved into 410 Taunt with one evolve, and then Alakir in the other evolve. <laughs> I mean, we probably would have won that if he didn't get exactly Alakir. If he skipped over a charging 8 drop. Right? Because 6 health there is it's kind of like a win. Dude, is at 7, and we had a 2 durability weapon with a bigger board than him. Mm. Mm, it's gonna hurt. Coined it though. The rushing mode goes a problem. Oh, I don't know. Kinda sucks. Mm. Yeah, we're getting out opener going first right now. Pretty unlikely. That was effectively a turn one, three, five. Oh, top deck tar creeper on three. There we go. So yeah, we're probably gonna lose this one now. Ridiculous four drop. A place to hide. Salt is strong, well. Just game after game after game right now of running up against ridiculous card quality and synergy. Like, our openers are pretty good. Even going first, they're pretty good. But 
<laughs> Discover Flame Strike. Okay. Once again, perfect curve. If only I went second. Nah, just had crazy stuff. Deck quality OP. It's gonna be Flame Strike. You know, he has that as well. Six games, four of them decided by first versus second. Two losses going first against craziest shit card quality in early game. Okay. Six games, four of them decided by. Wow. Wow. Crazy combo, crazy RNG. <laughs> and it's over. Can I please play without crying? Sure. Nah, dude, that's part of the stream. That's what I do. Are you Welcome. kidding me? The salty breath? It is I. The salty? From the vegetable wow. man. Wow. Give me another emote. Wow. How are you? Before you play your crappy wow. card. Uh, what the f How is that zero one? That guy's deck was crazy. Yeah. Six games, four of them decided by first versus second. Two losses going first against craziest shit card quality in early game. Okay. The main problem with typical mage decks is you get not enough answers. You get very few spells. The decks I've been playing against are very much exceptional in that. It's alright. Janelai, let's go. No spell mage. I was offered some spells, but they were all pretty damn weak. 67.4. I mean, I kind of called it. All those mage decks we're up against are quite exceptional in that regard, indeed. Wow. Wow! Crazy combo, crazy RNG. <laughs> On curve, shifting scroll flame strike. Some of us really get those things. Wasn't even that good. Bless you guys. I'd say it's pretty good. Uh. Fuck your shit. Playing pretty strong on curve. Have to see if I can keep up with this. He has to deal with the ward and heal now, which uh, is relatively hard most of the time. Value game it has to be then. <laughs> I'm not the beast in my right. I went with the BGH first. 
Just because I want more stats on the board right now, I might be able to finish the game. You're really close to lethal, but I think I'd rather take my time. Hey, Scotty. Jesus. Man. doesn't do damage. Oh my god. The one turn delay on Ragnaros <sighs> might cost me the game. And I maybe should have taken the chance of just pinging him down. I'd probably win like next turn. Your presence offends me. Okay. Oh god. What the hell is that? I get so far and then fucking RNG like shits on my face. In the last like five times that's been played against me, it cleared my board and developed one. This did not do that. God, I can't believe I lost this game. I, I did lose the game though. I can't. There's no taunt here. Can't play this, that's one off. I would have won if I just went straight ping face. And, um. I think I would have had a chance if I didn't ping the Divine Shield. Ping the Divine Shield delayed the rag by one turn, and that was the one turn I didn't have. Dropping those excuses. <sighs> yeah, everything's got reborn. It's like pretty tricky to get rid of all of it. enough. Your presence offends me. So many answers. Alright. Two left. I'm literally losing to drooling noob right now. That's kind of annoying, but we'll manage. Okay, that's really annoying. That's kind of annoying, but... I 
figure that might be it. Maybe I didn't play around it enough, I don't know. Could I have played around it more? I don't think so. I think that just sucks. That's the end. Another very strong answer. Another really, really good answer. That deserves an applause right there, boys. Who's got money on Pit Croc? I know I do. Seven left. Great. It's going to be okay. I forgot you had that. That value generation, damn. Divine shield again. Taunt again. <laughs> okay. Fine. Oh, I got a pit crack this time. Oh! That's an, that's an oof play. I missed out on the damage again from these divine shields. God. I'm not pinging the Divine Shield this time, okay? Not this time. How can you be so calm when someone spams repeatedly? You gotta be chill. Otherwise, streaming's probably not for you. Okay, I take that back. Otherwise, you probably wouldn't enjoy streaming whatsoever in any shape or form. You said what about me? Mom! Man, I am not getting that Janelai off ever. I think it might be a lot better in a different meta, but right now with Tempo Aggro, it's either too slow or too late. Too late to matter, that is. Like if a deck like mine makes it to that stage in the game, I've won already. Can I do any other kind of damage? Okay. Yeah, the only thing I can really do is build a board. Priest just has a lot of value. In this case, and traditionally. Being behind on the board against the Priest is really bad. Got him next turn if we really need him. Warning, he has mind control. How do you know? Well played. And it sure looks like he has mind control. It is a scream. And it's over! No, don't get an answer. There's the dragon. Dude! Are you fucking serious, man? Oh, that hurts. <laughs> All right. I am totally screwed with mind control. Yeah, I have quite a lot of bad draws in my deck, but I'm playing a priest with five cards left in his deck, so... We really just have to survive right now. Which is why he's trading right now. Just gotta survive. That's pretty bad. There's no way I can survive this, is there? Nope. Jen is not worth it. Um, I don't know. We mostly got wrecked by Psychic Scream and the 1010. If we had an active Jen then, that would have been alright. Pretty 
Priest is uh, really bad, but uh, Crush is mage. So. Yeah, I don't think we're getting any further. Let me show priest me. into Priest, I mean... Joke. There's no winning this. Top deck Shadow Word Pain. Ten top decks in a row is like... Give me okay. a fucking break. Dead. That is a pretty rough one. Super BM. You think we got sniped, guys? We are probably getting sniped in Hearthstone right now. Yeah, I'm starting to understand why we're playing tons of priests. We are probably getting sniped in Hearthstone right now. Literally cheating. Yeah, please don't snipe me, guys. What can I say? Beautiful! Oh my god. Might this be a win? Okay, might not be. Three left on that. Jesus, this takes forever. God, that's bad. Gotta do it, though. I do have Sia Matt. I do have Ethereal Conjure, like Frost Nova or something. Okay, he tapped. Alright. Okay, that's no good. Outskilled. Too late. You have awakened me too, too late. Oh. Wow. <laughs> we almost made it. by worthless imps. Well, it was a really long game, more so by the fact that the dude nearly roped me every single turn. Alright, let's see how many mages we'll play. And it's over! Can I please play without crying? Nah, dude, that's part of the stream. That's what I do. It is I. The vegetable man. How are you? What the f How is that zero one? That guy's deck was crazy. Oh god. What a lucker. Yeah right, dude. Yeah right. Alright.
44 clean. Wow. Divine shield on that one too. Oh god, that's really bad. Okay, we can tie here. I have to uh I have to kill the Sneeds and what comes out first, so. Okay, 50-50 here. Okay, hit me, hit me. Oh no, it's not 50-50. Okay, I just have to attack whatever is first. I lost. No! Oh, I'm just getting really fucked on our injury today, man. By the way, that little flip bullshit... That would have been the difference. Dude, I don't know how that guy had the things so much health. It's insane. Oh yeah, I also never got those. This is really unlikely. Can you hit that damn divine shield, dude? Alright. <clears throat> Kinda sucks the overkill doesn't work, because so much stuff has divine shield. Counter to mom bears is play stuff that's just way too small. And get a really lucky attack order. Okay, I could actually lose this. Every single overkill is nullified. Get that divine shield down. What a snipe. What a snipe! I lost! Oh my god, what are the chances of that? That's some bullshit. What a snipe! I lost! Oh my god, what are the chances of that? That's some bullshit. All of his attacks worked out, and like, none of my attacks worked out. Mech RNG is crazy. I'm trusting you guys, but I don't think he was playing Cleave. I think you're mistaken. Okay, he is playing Cleave. Yeah, he went off. He got Megasaurs now. The thing's at one, by the way. And it killed it for perfect lethal. And he sniped Mama Bear. I believe I can only tie right now. This has to kill that, and then... Oh no, if... I can actually win. But he has to get shitty. No, I got shitty luck again. Okay, fine. I can't get lucky against this guy. It's just too much poisonous. I have to get lucky with the rat. Killed the hide as the worst target. Basically, the reason this guy is even in the late game, look at this shit. He had two of them, right? Yeah, he had two of them and he played against weak players the whole time. Now we're guaranteed buffs, so just dodge the mama bear. Fuck me, man! Fuck me! How fucking lucky can you get? Instantaneous. Like... I think I've matched up against this guy four times, and I think I had good luck against what he played in none of them. 
can't kill me. It's a two. Okay, we got the good. We got the 50-50 there. Okay, that's good. Instant mama bear. Instant mama bear. First attack. Wow. That was fun. And by fun, I mean not fun. I don't think there is a way to win this. No. Dude, he killed the mama bear instantly five out of five times. The only time he didn't is when I was on the attack with the rat and he couldn't kill the mama bear. Taunt the rat packs? You can't, because if the rat dies first, that's a different kind of problem. You just need to not lose like a 1 in 4 or a 1 in 5 five times in a row. Crazy. Really? He soul juggled my soul juggler first hit. God likes snipes right now, dude. Oh my god, let me play it. Let me play it. I have too many minions? What? <laughs> and I lost the attack. Play without crying. Yeah, right, yeah, right. Nah, dude, that's part of the stream, that's what I do. Can I please play without crying? After everything you know, you think I could do something like that? Nah, dude, that's part of the stream, that's what I do. Can I please play without crying? Well, you think I could do something like that? It is I, the vegetable man. How are you? How is that zero one? That guy's deck was crazy. Really? Dude. What the hell? Both of those are from his deck. It didn't generate either of them. Six star minion indeed. Alright, this is some serious bullshit. Oh my god. Welcome to Arena Back to Battlegrounds. Dude, this card is absurd. This guy's played three against me. He only had two in his deck, but still. He played three. Last round had 17 cards left in his deck. That's just like not winnable. Now he's playing around Flame Strike. Oh my god. He 
this is more answers. Uh, okay. That was a really depressing run. I had pretty okay draws except for the first game, but I won the first game. It's just my opponent said crazy crap. Is it bad RNG or is like every deck having three tyrants in the first 13 cards? Yeah, that's a 100 point card. Alright, I want to look up this twin tyrant thing. This card is too common. Okay. Twin Tyrant is the most common card in the game. It's in 40% of decks, 1.2 copies. I mean, I obviously haven't played very much Arena, but that doesn't seem like a very good idea to me. That's like Kraken on steroids. Oh, dude, that's pretty, that's pretty annoying. It's a 3-6? Dude, that's bullshit in Arena. <laughs> is that why Paladin is so crazy? I can't hear power every turn. Literally every Paladin has it. The win more train begins. It's kind of dumb that all of this is happening because I couldn't deal with the side quest on turn one. Which really no one can deal with. Oh my god, he has more of those. <sighs> that was actually not a very satisfying game whatsoever. I lost on turn one. Okay. It's literally win more, win more, win more, win more, and I can't counter a one drop. Wow, that's some bullshit. Dude, this is just so absurdly crazy. Seriously. Like in this game, not even half the deck, I'm supposed to deal with two twin tyrants, and he used his first one on a single minion. Because who gives a crap, right? And you're on one of those, too. Lost both one and threes. <sighs> Third one. Is this really, like, regular arena right now? You just have like six copies of every single powerful card, and it's like worse card diversity than constructed. It's blowing my mind. I've only played like three hours of Arena this expansion, but I've already learned that half my opponents play this card and generally win with it. It's also the most common card offered in drafting, which kind of blows my mind. And also, apparently, you can get three of those board clears in not even half of your deck. Like, like if I was at 2-1 and one and got hit with three flame strikes before my opponent drew half their deck, I'd be like, Oh, no fucking way! Seriously, WTF, right? That's crap! That is straight up crap. Two flame strikes, 13 cards. One and one. Like, that's kind of the parallel. Just so you guys get a little bit of, you know, frame of reference on this one. Uh, okay. Yeah, I got really unlucky in the... Just the card result RNG as well, but I'm not so sure it would have mattered. Just some of these decks are, like, stupid insane. In my experience, the class that's good is, doesn't matter, just draft a lot of Twin Tyrants and screw around until you play more than your opponent does. That's, that's what seems to be really good. I mean, I'm, I'm not losing because of my drafting decisions. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> uh, look, if, if, if half of the choices I was offered were board clears and Twin Tyrants, I think I'd be doing okay. Rag and discover. Okay. 
Another one of those. Half his cards didn't start in his deck. He hasn't even drawn anything. Third one. How do you get three of anything? I didn't get three of anything, let alone really good cards. Seriously, like, come on. Every single opponent is playing, like, three of, like, every card against me. I dream and the world Yay, discovered Ysera. Such joy. Look at his hand right now. Random card from Arcane Breath, random card from Arcane Breath, random card from Arcane Breath, Ysera card. I'm pretty sure there's one more card in there that's not identified as a random card. He got a very early random card. He got a Spell Slinger. Yeah. I think a Spell Slinger is not identified. Basically, throughout the whole game, half his half his hand has been generated. He has four gen I Like, I have no idea what to play around. It's four generated cards right now. Has he got Double Dream or something? Is he going to try to tempo me out? Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. I guess Twin Tyrant is really that crazy. Alright. Well, it's a good thing it's the most common card in Arena. Still blows my mind. Like, an entire game that Mage had an at least 50% generated hand. The hero skin is so ugly. <laughs> Please. You're not into grandma trees or anything? Like, you gotta be more inclusive. This is 2019, alright? Ah, oh, crap. That's some shit right there. I haven't seen that dragon in a while. Wow. Oh, you just discover itself constantly. I guess I'll do that. It's okay, we'll breed it. I don't know how that works, it's only one dragon. We must stop this corruption. <laughs> Force it to breed with itself. Damn, dragons are advanced creatures. It still really feels like a freezing trap. Do I have to just risk it? I guess I can do this. That sucks. Six drop, damn it. Can I get a twin tyrant already? Guess I'm dead. Let's see if it was Freeze Trap after all. Yeah, it was. So I had no chance the whole game. Okay. That was pretty dumb. Yeah, I was winning handily until he got that dragon weapon and had massive card advantage from the 4-1 rushes. Because he was running out of cards, but he played two of the 4-1 rushes and it pulled that dragon in the end, and then, yeah. Day one of arena-ish. It is a bit of a mess. The power level is really high. The card offerings seem a bit out of whack, because, like, I don't know, half of our opponents are playing three copies of one card. That's crazy. Like, I mean, if they were control games, that would seem less crazy, but they're not. Almost every game ends about the halfway point through the deck. I don't know. Could also be Sniperonis have just been waiting for weeks with their latest and greatest creations. And lose equals bad. Um, no, that's just how the games are paced. There's so many, like, I win the game by playing this card and it's almost impossible to counter situations. The most broken cards are the most common neutral cards in the game. Like. That's kind of a mess. Like, you guys know in the past I would complain when, like, the best card in the game is like Abyssal Enforcer and somehow it's the most common card in the game. Well, that's happening right now, except that card is a neutral. So, that's... 
that's different. <laughs> that's not that's not good. In in my opinion of fun at least, that's not good. Like imagine if Abyssal Enforcer was neutral and it was also the most common card offered in drafting. Is that like oh awesome? No, that's like uh really? Uh, about half my losses are to, like, triple Twin Tyrants today. I didn't have that many. And the card wins by itself. So, yeah. Guess that's that. And it's over! Can I please play without crying? <laughs> oh! Nah, dude, that's part of the stream. That's what I do. Hey guys, how's it going? Greg is here. <laughs> oh, we nailed that. In sync. <laughs> what do we have for them? So. Yeah, Crips here. Sad professionalism. Look at that. You can see if it's straight like that. Straight. Like this. Oh my god, 45 degrees. It fell off my hands, and I, I didn't want it to fall on the ground because this might break. <laughs> Skill? What do you mean? I, I do! Okay, here. These are the hands of a surgeon. <laughs> oh, you can't see. Wait. There. Is this a tripod case? So, this thing? It's like a, it's like a reusable it condom. <laughs> what? Guys, don't be embarrassed. That is way too big, okay? Just some people are born that way, you know? <laughs> <laughs> so, assume that you have something in here. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and then, if you put it in here and it's too big, uh -huh. you get this. You can even hold things outside of it. That's why these thingies are. You can, like, put this here. Then it's here. Okay. It has um, more of these, so you uh, put it like uh, like an X, so it holds it in place. This is like duct tape. Almost over, bro. I think we actually got it right here, right here. Inferno Diablo, fucking world first, hardcore. Let's do it. Come on, bro. I can kick fucking tire it. Right. There he <laughs> oh goes. My God. Done. He wanted to kill me. So bad at the end. I can't fucking yell because people are sleeping in the house right now, but damn, damn. It's been done. Been done. The crypts gotten in the house. Alright, there you go. You wanna nerf our shit? You wanna nerf our shit? That's okay. That's okay. <laughs> we'll just do act four in six hours on hardcore. Inferno. No problem. Six hours is all we need. Alright. Uh, this is for popping. Don't you wanna pop? Are you doing this? Look like oh, you, you should no no wait 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 you should you should draw eyes and in the face on that. It looks already like it has ears. Wait. Dex is not like this. No. Yeah. It's very ooh. It's so cute. You're a real artist. I honestly, this is better than half the <laughs> art streams I've seen. Isn't it so cute? We are artists now. <laughs> you killed it! What did you do? You brutal! <laughs> yeah, that's just crying! <laughs> Hardcore. Oh, it's next to Forsenstad. Oh, okay. All we have to do is find force instead. Fine, let's um, let's try to walk a bit more. Force instead. Yeah, don't you know force instead? It's right next to failed Minecraft Ronstad. <laughs> sleepy Dex, sleepy. No matter how cute you look, and you look very cute, we're busy. We're busy, Dex. Oh. Oh, 
get wrecked. Oh, that's good. Okay. Easy. Why would you put sardines can in the fridge? Ooh, you know what toilet means, don't you? Alright dudes, we're going to check out a bounty here. It is just going to be a minute. If you guys uh, don't mind sticking around, I'd appreciate it. We are going to play some more afterwards. Okay, don't, don't, don't do that. It's, it is, this is a video. <laughs> Alright, let's check it out. Unfollowed. <laughs> oh, chickpea soaking water? It wouldn't be the water. It would have to be potato My starch. That it's C. Okay, C. It might be chickpeas soaked in water, but that's not what that says. Is that your final answer? Oh, yes. That's my final answer. All right. No let's help. find out the right answer together. That's the wrong answer. What? Fake vegan and fake nerd. <laughs> I'm looking this up. Well, it's really funny because whenever we go out to eat. Uh, if like one person gets the order and it's like a Buddha bowl of like quinoa and kale and avocado or something and steak and then another person brings the order they never ask they just give me the bowl and him the steak and we're like no, no. other way is it true no it's actually wrong i was right what do you mean it's wrong Soak chickpeas in water overnight, completely submerged. Drain and rinse the soaked chickpeas. Pressure cook until soft. This is how you make a vegan egg. It's not the water. The question was wrong. Literally. Yes. This is now that's a good start. Oh, hell yeah. Good luck beating this shit. Stay on two, more death rattle. I just, uh, I want tokens. Like, I don't think the size of these things matters that much. You mostly lose, like, Divine Shield Point. Oh, man, this guy's really strong. What the hell? Oh, I lost. Good try, kid. It's a good try. Oh my god, let me play that. Oh my god, what the hell? What? I couldn't... P those carrots are bullshit. You guys saw it, I couldn't click the card. The carrots don't let you queue up the next animation. Dude, carrots are ridiculous. I'm not- Back to Kel. Whoa. Wait, what? Uh, okay. That, does that work? Eight. Okay. Oh, yeah? Hmm. Okay. That's pretty weird. I could have sworn that card is the same as that card in... I don't know. Okay. Ah, my bad, guys. I don't, I don't know what I was thinking, actually. I found an uneaten brand new jar of peanut butter pretzels. Oh, my God. Do you want to go in there? Yes. So he found more peanut butter pretzels. I consumed, uh, I guess, three of three, three of those things in like a week and a half, and I'm like, I really want some more, but you shouldn't order because I'll get fat. <laughs> Did you order any? No, I didn't. God damn it. Was this supposed to? Um, well, you know. I'm sorry. If you, if you, if you, if you, if you love me for reasons outside of my waistline, maybe. <laughs> what is, what is that thing? Should I order some more? Switch on the road. 
All right, what do you think? Should I order more peanut butter pretzels? Hold on. <sighs> I'm so demanding for someone so small. Haven't you seen those chihuahuas? What are you talking about? I'm demanding exactly because I'm so small. Yeah, go to the front. <laughs> Guys, <laughs> we can't film him too much because he needs to breathe. <laughs> uh, what are you talking about? <laughs> Order just one jar? Ordering just one jar? Jesus, dude. They won't even ship in one jar to you, are you serious? Ordering one jar is like getting orange juice and then there's not enough for a full glass and you're like, fuck. That's ordering one jar. Ban yeah. Ban him. Like, do you really want to torture people or what? Or getting one jar is like getting a super small bag of chips and you're like, oh, at least I'll get some chips when you open it. <laughs> still 90% air. <laughs> this one's good too. Okay. No, it's not. It's a joke. What do you oh. mean? Look at it. <laughs> I mean, I, I don't know anymore. This nail polish, remember, doesn't remove shit. Oh yeah, from that distance it looks great. It's fine. It doesn't remove it. It's fine. It's not fine. You're gonna judge me. It's like, oh yeah, he had it on the side. Yeah, no shit, I had it on the side. <laughs> I mean... Gimme. It's free. You shouldn't be picky, right? A guy is like, yeah, $5 is not a lot of money. Just, you know, just go take your mom's credit card from her purse and subscribe for $5. That is so fucking scummy. Where is the chicken? Uh, I saw it a second ago. Can we just go chase it back? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna chase it back. Oh, you're Hello, like... Hello, ma'am. Crip here with Chicken Chasing Services. Get that chicken off my At backyard. Yes. Okay. I can. I see the chicken. I see the chicken too. Wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna run full speed at it. Wait, let me. Let me. There. <laughs> chicken doesn't care. Oh I have no idea what happened. Maybe the chicken won. What happened? It doesn't want to go back. It doesn't want to go back? No. The chicken eventually got a bit afraid of the broom so I could like guide it. But the instant I, I went to like the small gap in between the fence with our neighbor who has the chickens. It just booked in a different direction. Like, it even flew over the broom. <laughs> Tell us the true story when I saved the kitten stuck in a drain pipe. Yeah, so once upon a time, there was this kitten, and it was stuck in a drain pipe. And then I got it out. And then I ate it. It was delicious. <laughs> this has got protein. What do you mean? Protein. I gotta get that protein, dude. No, that's a great story. <laughs> Peta? No, no, it's okay. The the kitten was gonna cause global warming. Yeah, dude, it was ready to, like... It was ready to drop a methane-infused fart. Okay. I just saved the world. I give up, dude. This is when you put me with random randomness. <laughs> Maybe I'll get a taunt totem at least. Yay. Don't heal him. Fuck me, man. 
Come on, dude, someone at Blizzard must be trolling me right now. <laughs> there are ten targets. This has to be the lucky you've ever the worst luck you've ever seen. Welcome to the stream. You might be you must be new here. Oh, I didn't realize your Canadian tweet got that much traction. Mm -hmm. Fuck, I'll just retweet it now. It's a late retweet, but I'm doing it. I even got like some replies from like radio stations in the area and from the official account of like Lake Erie or something. Oh, and this is a really good photo. I wonder who took this. <laughs> I wonder how long it took to that person to take this photo. You can't rush perfection. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fair enough. Crypto identifies a man with good RNG. I Don't refuse it. to identify as a man with good RNG. He does not have. He he he. I I think Crips RNG is very. Uh, regular, you know. Sometimes it's good. Sometimes it's bad. But I do think because he gets very salty. And because Chad loves it when there is bad RNG, the bad RNG gets way more attention. So that's all that's left. I'm sorry, I have to overrule you. I'm going to pull up today's video and see if Chance Arena has commented on it. But he gives a history of my RNG and it is, it is overall below average. Right. It's, it's numbers. Right. You, you trust the numbers, don't you? Okay, what is, where is Chance Arena? Here we go. Salt Arena, where's Chance Arena? Is Chance Arena sleeping today? Jesus, Chance Arena! Did I heart your comments for nothing over the last few months? Toptic Ragnaros. Really? Man. Dude, that's some serious cheat codes. Seriously. That was like not fair level of cheat codes. Yeah, Rag hit me to the face with like five minions when he was just going totally smark. After a crazy opener that miraculously did tons of damage to me, like miraculously. <laughs> 